Um, the next speaker is Elizabeth Truss from Oxford West and Abingdon and president of the Oxford University Liberal Democrats. And would Norman Baker stand by, please, Elizabeth. Conference. Before addressing this amendment, I have a few words for the press, <laughs> who seem to be taking a close interest in this debate. <laughs> this party, unlike Labour, will not duck and weave from debating the issues people are interested in. When they come, <laughs> when they come to examine what we stand for, unlike the figure at the centre of this debate, we will not be caught with no clothes on. There are two main problems with this amendment conference. It does not give us a Dutch bicycling monarchy. In fact, the amendment does not change the position of the monarch at all. It does not allow women to succeed the same as it allows men to succeed. It will not abolish any of the current constitutional powers that the monarch has. And moreover, this amendment does not give the people of Britain a say. It gives them no chance to vote on a referendum. I agree with Paddy Ashdown when he said, everybody in Britain should have the chance to be a somebody. But only one family can provide the head of state. We Liberal Democrats believe in opportunity for all. We believe in fairness and common sense. We believe in referenda on major constitutional issues. We do not that believe that people should be born to rule or that they should put up and shut up about decisions that affect their everyday lives. Do you, conference, believe that? Do you? I was being interviewed by Newsnight earlier this afternoon. <laughs> and we were filmed asking members of the public what they thought about the monarchy. We came across a group of three people. I'd say they were around 50, 60, look fairly middle class, rather smart, in fact, rather reactionary, to be perfectly frank. <laughs> we asked them their opinion of the monarchy. Do you know what they said? They said, abolish them. We've had enough. <laughs> but believe it or not, conference, they didn't say this once. We met another group of people and another group of people and all three groups of people said abolish the monarchy. <laughs> in fact, conference, in fact, conference, we couldn't find a single monarchist outside the royal pavilion. How <laughs> ironic. I believe that the disillusioned of Brighton should have a chance to vote on this issue because I believe, like most Liberal Democrats, in democracy. Democracy with a capital D. Thank you, conference. Vote against Amendment 1 and vote for the motion. Thank you, Elizabeth. I like our party, don't you? Norman, uh, Norman Baker, if you'd come to the uh, rostrum, and will Helen Elsom stand by, please?